Now, at 24 months, the myelination is now adult-like or near adult-like, um, comprising of T1 bright and T2 dark white matter tracts. Notice also that the subcortical U fibers here are also myelinated, unlike in the earlier stages. Additional uh, buzzwords to remember uh, is that near adult T1 weighted images are seen by 8 months and then near adult T2 by 18 months. So remember these concepts, we will apply them later. Myelination begins in the second trimester. So in utero, there is already myelination and then continues after birth. Just to recall what are these myelinated regions at birth, we try to clump them according to function and associate it with this uh, sentence. Baby must be awake with eyes open to grab the milk bottle. So these are a set of T1 weighted and T2 weighted um, images in a newborn. So to recall, uh, to associate the region of the dorsal brainstem, we think about the basic functions that the brainstem um, would allow. So the baby must be awake, which would correspond to reticular formation in the brainstem. Baby must be awake, so it has to be myelinated. So dorsal brainstem, we have hyperintense here, and then hypointense on T2. What about eyes open? We use that word to associate it with the optic tract, which should be myelinated. And then to grab, this is associated with motor function. So at birth, there are areas which control motor functions, which are myelinated. Remember that for the motor, for a baby to move, to make movements, there are, the motor track would start in the motor cortex, in the pyramidal cells, which would then send axonal tracks through the posterior limb of the internal capsule here, and then later on um, descend in the cerebral peduncles. There's also another area which is myelinated at birth, the thalamus. And we just think about thalamocortical connections, which are sensory and motor in function. Other areas which are shown here are the cerebellar peduncles, which are myelinated also at birth. And let's just um, associate it with the structures which uh, control posture and movements in the newborn baby, and hence should be myelinated already at birth. 